Hello everybody, Pinstripe here. What is going on? Welcome back to the Grunt Squad Challenge. Today we're going to be taking on Trotsville, continuing with Saving Private Rind. Uh, so with this one, it's the French dudes. And we have plenty of snipers to deal with in this one. Alongside a bombardier. If I do decide to do hard mode, it's going to be... Oh, it's going to be hella tricky on this level. Uh, but for the time being, uh, I have health on this map. I have additional weapons on this map. So there is a fair, you know, helping hand. And the snipers themselves tend to stay on this top section of the map and just try and shoot at you through this metal wall, which is never going to happen. Oh dear. <laughs> I just wanted to try it and see if it worked, but for once it actually did. So, we're going to grab the health and we're going to go ahead and try and knock off the sniper that is closest to the minefield. Now, hopefully we'll have our first confirmed kill uh, in this early stage. But with my next turn, I really need to go and take care of the bombardier. That missed a little bit, but hopefully... There we go. Nice. So one... Oh, it's his turn next. Well, one sniper's dealt with, and hopefully this shot is not very good. But it's going to be... Ooh, it's a bit long, actually. Okay. Not what I was expecting. But there is a health crate next to the bombardier. So I can continue to just chuck grenades at him and hope that he just shoots me because if he starts using that mortar then we're going to be in trouble so I'm going to position myself down here just in case he shoots or if he lands down here so I can kind of knock him down to me that'll do me some good he's going to do that <laughs> Uh, there is an airstrike up there, but obviously I don't have any uh, jetpacks or any method of getting up there. So instead, I went the wrong way. Instead, we're going to grab this health and then we're going to grab the, I think it's a homing missile. A couple of homing missiles, which we can then use on the snipers. Just going to make sure I get there in time. Should be okay. Just about. Then we just get him. Like I said in my last video, or one of these videos, you are able to find the snipers on the map uh, with the airstrike or homing missile because uh, you can see the sniper's breath on the map. Which, as far as I can tell, uh, was intentional. Okay, so all of my pigs are up here now. I just need to try and stay alive. <laughs> Doesn't matter again if we lose any pigs. Whoa. He might die actually, because he doesn't really have any way of getting out of there. Oh, I didn't mean to knock him down. So hopefully he shoots me. He might be slightly too far away so he might do the dumb thing and use his mortar. These two seem focused on my pig in the center. But, I mean... Okay. <laughs> Saving myself a lot of trouble here. Uh, he's just far away enough. For this one, I don't need to go full power, because you don't want it going crazy. Did damage myself, but that should be okay. And he's on 60. And that's my homing missiles done. We're in a we're in a decent place. 
We've got some, still got some health. Still got everyone intact. Everyone's alive. He's not hurting anybody. <laughs> oh, and it damages him as well. Oh, beautiful. Now just shoot me. Yes. Wonderful. Who's next? Oh, that guy, obviously. Is he dead? He's not dead. He is dead. Okay. So that just leaves a sniper who's <laughs> gone all the way down there and the bombardier. <laughs> okay. That has saved me so much, this mission. Just the dude in the center. Nice, so he's got 30 health, he's got 34, and he's doing a dumb thing. That's gonna damage himself. I mean, that's okay, to be honest. 27, oh, my pig's dead. See, I knew he'd ruin it, somehow. He'd find a way. Oh well. Uh, is that pig near me? I can't really. I don't think so. Whoa. Take him down. Downtown. Oh dear. <laughs> oh, that could be good. Oh, it is good. All the way down. <laughs> Look at him go. Lovely. So, that is saving Private Rind. On to the next mission. Just Desserts is one of the simpler maps. If anything, it's a lot easier for me because I have a freaking tank and that provides me as a grunt with some hefty armor. Alongside that, we've also got health crates which I can pick up in the tank and then do some destruction with my air burst and uh, bazooka combo. Ouch. So the tank is perfect for going across minefields. As you saw just then, we only took eight damage, which in comparison to, well, just a pig, you would take freaking tons of damage if you fell in one. So what I really need to do is uh, try and steal their tanks. Because by doing so, we just ensure that both spies don't hop inside them and take them for a spin like this dude. Because now we have to deal with a separate tank who is going to take forever to actually take his turn, do something, and not bore everyone to death. <laughs> there's been a few times in this Grunt Squad series where there's just a lot of silence because we spend most of our time waiting for the enemy to take their turn. And that is a fairly decent shot. What a douche. So yeah, like I said, we'll go grab a tank because we don't want a tank battle. No, thank you. And we'll grab the one that is preferably the least damaged. Then we can sort of do something with it. Probably damage the spy that is currently hiding. So this one has... 141, that's plenty. Oh, yes, do it. Oh, so much damage. 49, not actually as much as you think it is, but it felt like it was. So now that I'm in that tank, he won't jump into the other tank. Because that's just too confusing for him. Again, just do the same thing. 
Actually, no. I'm going to grab one of our tanks and just charge at them. <laughs> Go crazy. We need to get some damage in on the other tank uh, before we do anything else, really. Because the pyrotechnics will either use their flamethrower or do something stupid. So we can risk that for now. So I'm just going to get as far forward as we can. I'm going to park right next to him. And I'm going to shoot this dude. Trying my best not to damage my own tank. Oh, he only shoots it. That's disappointing. <laughs> I was expecting something more crazy. So, same thing again, pretty much. Except this time I'm just going to... Actually, where did that spy land? If we can take him out. Which I think we have. That does us a world of good. What's he going to do? Oh boy. I think it's going to explode. <laughs> this, oh, my pig's... Oh, my pig might be alive. No, he's dead. Okay. No, oh, and he killed himself. What a dude. What a dude. Okay. Best thing I can do is probably grab the health that's over here. Um, the pig with no tank, so I need to grab this. The sooner the airstrike drops, the better, because we can just end it really in one fail swoop. And if I can just get a quick granada in on those dudes. Now what's he going to do? Ooh, jumps out. Ooh. Best way to get him out of there. Who dare shoot my tank? In the mines. Yes. Extra damage is good damage. Uh oh. <laughs> Incoming shell. Ooh. That's alright though. As long as I stay close to this, he can't hurt me. <laughs> Very soft bazooka explosion. Oh, hello there. <laughs> oh, he is... He is obliterated. And my pig is dead. Well, for the hell of it, we'll grab the medal. And grab the medal! And we may as well stay in the tanks. Save our life. A little bit too short. There's the airstrike, but we don't really need it now. I don't know how much health I have. Enough? Yeah. Um... Okay. So he's dead. One dude left. It's fine. I've got loads of health. Try me. I'm going to do it the old fashioned way. You ready? Drive right at him. He'll never see it coming. Run over the boots. That's satisfying. 
I'm coming for you like a snake. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Anticlimactic, but either way, we win. That is just desserts. On to the wonderful <sighs> glacier guns. And so there are no tanks to help us in this mission, but uh, my plan at the moment is to grab as much health as I can, which at this stage isn't really that much. Um, but it's that and the combination of just whittling down the health of these pillboxes. Obviously we have some assistance after we have destroyed a pillbox. But the other task will be to... Oh dear. <laughs> the other task will be to grab the anti-pillbox mines that are on the far side of the map. Which is where I'm going to head to now. Because the sooner we get a pig out of his pillbox the better... Because the more weapons we get and the sooner we can start attacking the pigs that are inside the pillboxes. Obviously they outrank us, they are all gunners, so we've got to pay attention to the distance we are from them and ensuring that they use their uh, bazookas, no wait, ensuring that they use their pistols and that we don't get hit. Oh, I'm kind of exposed here, so I'm just going to... Okay, that should do it. I grabbed the health. That's what matters. I didn't have enough time to get the, the mines. I could have, but meh. He's kind of safe behind the tree, I hope. Maybe not. And he has, like, no health whatsoever. So... I'm going to walk backwards, which you may think is crazy, but I need to, because it makes me move just that little bit faster. Okay, so I'm going to make my way over to my teammate. Um, as you know... I'm going to go up here, and I'm going to hide behind a tree, like a bitch, because I need to. Can I hit the pillbox? No. Oh, 11 damage, there you go. That's, that's something at least. I am protected. You cannot hit me. Not today. The tree will protect me. So I need to position myself in areas that are A, not exposed, and B, can allow me to attack pillboxes without being directly in view of other pillboxes. Bounce. No, okay. Waste of grenades there, I know, but... Oh, no. Please don't die. <laughs> I need you to live. He's... He's so dead. He lives. Alrighty. Same strategy. Which actually might just be... Can I just stand? No, I can't stand there. If I stand at its like lowest point... No, that's, that's too exposed. I'm going to go hide by these trees. Which I know isn't much, but it gives me some cover. Some cover. If I can damage this pillbox... Oh, that's wonky. 17 damage. <laughs> it's not going so well. You can't hit me. Right? Yeah. Okay. Good. Same routine. Oh, 
Come on, shoot me. Oh, okay. Shoot the tree. Yes. It's a slow method. But I feel like it's one that works. So now I can finally start damaging these guys. So to run the hell away. Okay, I think that went well. <laughs> There's the rocket launcher. He's on 40. And I think he's going to kill me. Oh, shoot me. And the tree, the tree works. Okay, now I can do the same thing as last time, but just run myself along here. Because I need that health. do the same thing. We're going to go back to the same spot because I'm running out of time. And we don't want to get hit again because otherwise that uh, collection would have been worth nothing. Oh, uh, that was too far. <laughs> uh, I have wasted a lot of grenades in this in this round. He's going to hit me, isn't he? Okay. Good. Good, good, good. Okay, we're doing some damage. He's gonna die. <laughs> Is he? Yeah, he's dead. Alright. But that's okay. Because I have a rocket launcher. And I am going to aim it at your face. Oh dear. My aim is everywhere today. Into the water. Oh. Cool. So now I need to send one of my minions to collect the anti pull box mines again. Oh, thank God. <laughs> thank goodness that missed. But first. No, you son of a. I can just shoot this one. Get him out of there. Get me some more ammunition. Oh, now I've got to worry about his... His capabilities, which hopefully are... Yeah, pretty terrible. Still hits me, though. Okay, I'm going to go for the... Pillbox mines. Just need to make sure that we don't lose too many pigs. Finish with at least two, I reckon. That's a solid, solid amount. the airstrike. Oh no. Oh thank goodness. <laughs> oh, thank god for bouncing targets. Alright, rocket launcher. And we can grab ourselves the airstrike. Hide behind the tree. Hopefully that'll reach.
Yeah, that's good. That's oh, kind of good. So, three versus four. Forgot how many pigs I had. <laughs> That was way off. Alright, now I can take out this dude. No more trouble caused by him. Dokie. I'll take that. I'll definitely take that. <laughs> I'm surprised that happened. It didn't look like anything was blocking him, but apparently the pillbox didn't want to be out of the way. And now he's going to pay the price. I think this mission gifts you a lot of stuff. I mean, it's everything you need to take down the pillboxes, but then it just goes even further and it's like, ah, oh, here's two airstrikes and more rocket launchers and, you know, just do your thing. <laughs> plus anti-P mines. Plus a jetpack as well. Hit the tree. Yeah. Tree protection. Get it while stocks last. Ooh, I've got a good idea. Oh, you douchebag. Oh well, I'm going to do it anyway. Hmm. Yeah. Whoa, where did he go? Whoa. <laughs> he flew away. Oh, don't die. Please don't die. He missed. Rocket launcher to finish it off. You betcha. Gotta make sure. Jesus. <laughs> oh, 23. So close. This will be interesting. This will be very interesting. Full power! <laughs> Extreme. Well, that is Glacier Guns, everybody. Certainly a mission that can be challenging, but you just need to figure out your order of attack essentially but uh, on to the next one boys no survival bonus again uh, i can live with that you know so because we have no jetpack to get over to the other side we are going to focus on well just shooting the dudes you know not much else to it really <laughs> you've got an airburst you shoot it at full power and you let it do the rest. All while trying to dodge mortar shots. Which thankfully aren't the most damaging, but this mission does worry me a little bit for the time being. I like the construction of this map and the mission, but I mean, I don't know. At this level, when it's just like, just collect the airburst, shoot them. It's, it's a very, very simple mission. And that constant influx of airburst is, is great. Like, it feels awesome to shoot them at full power at these dudes, but I don't know. It's just one of the simpler missions. And that is a 
almost a direct hit on my player. That is insane. And I have no way of healing him. I guess the best thing to do is to stay... Stay inside these areas. But also making sure that I don't blast myself away. Ugh, not quite. Still a little bit of damage, but... Mm, I don't know. I'm worried now. <laughs> I was worried to begin with, and now I'm even more worried because these guys are just dead. My other pigs are very much hurt. And he's on 15 and 30, and oh boy. Not looking good. I'm going to be adventurous. I need to... I don't know, use the windmill or something? I think the better idea would be to go out into the minefield, but I don't want to do that. Get in there. Not quite. Ah, always just slightly too short. 34 and 20, so they're almost dead. Oh, hit the, hit the windmill. Okay, maybe not. Miss. Miss again? So he's still got full health, right? Yeah, he's still got 50. So he's my... He's my main hope at the moment. He's going to stay put in here. And I need to target these guys because they have... A lot of health at the moment. <laughs> Oh, 24 and 20. Good. Good, good, good. It's going well. I, I said it. I've jinxed it. Please. Do something funny. <laughs> Miss your shot or something. I don't know. Hit the windmill. Hit the windmill. Hit the windmill? He didn't hit the windmill. He's dead. It's going to be a close one, but I think if I can hit this next shot... If I can take out those guys... Oh, are you serious? <sighs> if this bites me in the ass now, I swear to God. Don't you... Frickin... <sighs> what is it with the airship? Seriously. Ruining all of my shots and all my videos. <laughs> okay, they're dead. There's two. I can definitely get the other two. Can't even see him. Don't want to know. Get out of here. So, feel free to kill one of my pigs. I don't care. Do what you want. Because I'm going to kill you in my next turn. Unless the airship just continues being a douche. Right, you up there? No? Okay. I'm going to shoot them again. Is that cool? I hope so. That's what should have happened in the first place. <laughs> Alright, well that was Battle Stations. Which turned out to be a lot more troublesome than it had to be. I know there's better strategies. I could go through the minefield. I could collect the... Is it a weapon? I don't even know what weapons they are. I never go out in the minefield. It's just the thing I do, you know? On to the next mission. So, Fortified Swine is all that stands between us and taking Trotsville. We've had a smooth run so far and haven't had any failures except for trying to get a super airburst and uh, getting blown up by mines on mission 6. But other than that, we haven't had any restarts, which has been nice. But uh, once we get to the next island of Beliopolis, that's when things start to get even more tricky. Uh, for the moment, my aim is to grab this health crate and then uh, do something, do something helpful, like throw a grenade, you know? I'm hoping that I can detonate that. 
Yes. More damage on that spy, the better. And, well, we need to take out that pyrotechnic and take out that spy as well. Otherwise, ooh, got lucky. Otherwise, he's going to just be a nuisance. But we can take him down with a single bullet. Which will basically be just taking out this explosive barrel. So he is dead. Because he will always fall into the minefield and hopefully this dude will shoot the tree. Yes. Okay, the tree did not protect me. Understood. Um, I know there's a better way of getting getting over there. I don't know how. Is it this way? Like, do I run across here? Okay. <laughs> this I've never used that strategy before. I always just swim across because, well, come on, guys. I don't play as grunts very often. <laughs> so I'm going to do the same thing. I know this I know this tree can protect me. I know it's possible. It can happen. Fall in the water. Oh, almost. He's on 44. Just like go to sleep or something or throw something. Go to sleep. Shoot the oh, he's shooting his teammate. Beautiful shot there. Thank you very much. Alright, same routine. Going over the bridge. Don't need to waste any health. It's just, you know, nothing signposted when you're a grunt. <laughs> There's nothing you can do. That was just beautiful, wasn't it, guys? I thought he had fallen down. What is he doing? <laughs> he has done the damage that I failed to do. Expertly done. Just marvellous. Loved it. Do it again. Please. <laughs> Shoot me. No. With your... Okay, well, that was my fault. <sighs> Although, I'd probably still be dead. Even if I hadn't taken that damage. That's okay, I guess. It's three versus three at this point. So... I'm just going to use this to protect myself. Just in case any of the spies decide to try and shoot me. Eight damage! Oh, God damn it. Oh, he's like point blank in front of him. Thanks for that tree. Really helpful. Okay, I need to kill... I need to kill the pyro. I'll probably shoot him, actually. Don't want to waste any bullets. Or don't want to waste any grenades. Actually, no. Screw it. I'm going to damage both of them. Oh, yes. More damage. So he's on 15. Go on, shoot your teammate again. <laughs> I insist. The tree. It doth protect me. Now protect me again, tree. I need you. Bounce. Yes. Awesome. So, Trotsville is ours. And the tree has not protected me. <laughs> ah, it's okay. I was expecting. I was expecting casualties. But 
Shotsville, ladies and gentlemen, is mine. And I hope you have all enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts on the Grunt Squad Challenge so far. What are your thoughts? Do you think I can do things better? Because I know I can make improvements. Um, they're always needed. And I think for this mission is to use the bridge. Really, use that bridge. Uh, but in the meantime, I'll catch you guys later for the next one.